here with guitarjams.com. You can click down there. You can try the site out for free for three days if you like. A little test drive, if you will. Got nothing to lose. I'm going to teach you a kind of a more of an advanced kind of, uh, kind of lick concept for you. And uh, let's do it right now. Okay, this, <clears throat> you can kind of think of this as a D blues. So I've got the D root right there on uh, the 10th fret. And you can think of your pentatonic as kind of the skeleton. And this is a little way you can kind of take that skeleton and it's really though, we're changing a few notes to make it what's called D mixolydian. So it's definitely more of a major -y, you know, blues major -y kind of feel. And this comes from kind of a, you know, Eric Johnson, Joe Bonamassa, Jeff Beck kind of concept where we're going to be um, outlining a D7 chord a little more than just a straight pentatonic. So let me show you what we're going to do. We've got the ring finger on the 15th fret, you know, on this little box right here. And that would be the straight minor pentatonic, but when it's mixolydian, it's actually 15-14, not 15-13. Then 15-14 on the B. And so the little trick is this. You hit it with your ring finger, then from, so we got 15. Then the 14, you bend up to the same note as the 15. And you can let it go back down. Then 15, 13 on the B. Then we're going to do the same concept with this note and we're going to slide down to the 12 and bend it up to that note. So, so far we have this. And so you can go 14, 12 on the G, and then 11 on G, same, same idea. So watch. same thing is going to go all the way down and you know it's not necessarily a lick where you're going to do it all the way you know in as many octaves as you as you can it's just another concept even if I'm just in this little uh, box right here. you know yeah, it's just new ideas basically so we have Then you can go ring finger to the 12th fret on the D. When you get to the 9 on the D, we can actually, once you get to the D string, you kind of want to bend it this way as opposed to up. So we're going to run out of uh, neck. So we've got, remember we're in D. Then same thing on the A string. time
that's all kind of a mixolydian, demixolydian concept. So now let me just show you in the home row kind of version of that. We can go on the B string, pinky, on the 13th fret, and then ring finger on the 12th fret, bending up to that note. Jeff Beck does that quite a bit. See that? So we've got... just do the B and G string of it and the rest can just be kind of your pentatonic. Once again, guitarjams.com. I got a ton of lessons on there, most of which are not on YouTube. So if you want to get deeper into this whole guitar playing thing, uh, I would love for you to come over there and you know try it out for free or, or see what's going on. Uh, in the meantime, keep practicing, and I'll keep practicing as well, and, and come back with a new lesson real soon. See you later.